If our regulatory agencies, if the EPA is being run by people from Exxon, if FDA is being run by people from Monsanto, if the CDC is filled with people from Merck and Pfizer and Sanofi Aventis, we no longer have regulatory agencies. We, they have been captured by the industries we're supposed to be being protected from. And, and, and is it also correct that um, some of these commercial groups are even allowed to vote on their own vaccines? Yes, and we have evidence of this, in fact, proof of it. The, you have the FDA, but then you have this board of directors, essentially like 12, a dozen people that vote on a product. They sit in a room, I've been to these rooms, and the manufacturer comes in and presents their new product and shows all the great science behind it and the trials. And then that group you know, votes on whether this vaccine should be approved for the market. Once it's approved for the market, it goes over to the CDC, the CDC's group, which I've done a lot more focused research on ACIP, the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices. They then vote on whether that vaccine will be added to the childhood schedule or the adult schedule. I want to point out there is an adult schedule because that's my point. That's where this is all going. It's going to be a forced vaccination program for adults. Many people aren't aware of it.